اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم In this session we are going to look into how to use his process macro with a categorical independent variable a categorical moderator and a continuous dependent variable Now in this example I've got my x as type of bank it can be private or public m here moderator is job rank it can be junior middle or senior so if i draft this model here onto a word document so type of bank affects the reliability of service which is a continuous variable and this relationship is moderated by job rank which is a multi categorical variable type of bank two categories uh i think i represented zero for public banks and one for private how to do such analysis in his process macro here is my data set now here are the three job ranks i've already created the dummy variables but in his process macro we do not need to create dummy variables his process macro does it for us the type of bank Zero is for public, one is for private, as I mentioned. So how do we do this analysis? Go to analyze, regression, process macro. Now, if you look here, this here is your dependent variable, reliability of service. This here is your independent variable. This is your moderator, and this is your model number one. Now, as we saw in the model diagram. this is model number 1 so if you want to assess one moderator that can be multi categorical you need model 1 with an iv and a dv now in this case the objective of the assessment is that type of bank impacts the reliability of service however this reliability of service may be moderated by the job rank how we are going to look into this let's see the results now but before we do that you have to go to multi categorical option here select the multi categorical option so which one is your multi categorical variable here your moderator is multi category variable job rank it is junior middle and senior so select multi categorical coding system by default indicator we are going to leave it as is press continue your dependent variable your independent variable type of bank and your moderator model number 1 all else is fine just press okay now here are your results again it is always a good idea to look into this now your dependent variable was reliability your independent variable was type of bank your moderator was rank now since the job rank was multi categorical variable His process macro has done the coding of the categorical W variable for the analysis. Now this here one, one here means junior. This is your reference category. So all the results that involve the categorical variables, that is your W, compared to this reference category. Number two, here W one. You see a one here. This is your middle. job rank this is your senior job rank 3 so let's look at the results now first your outcome variable reliability let me do the model here just quickly type and that affects reliability of service moderated by job rank now output reliability overall model summary the r value r square 0.03 Zero one. This means three percent change in reliability can be accounted to these 
exogenous variables here and then your F statistics and all other results and is this significant is this change that is R square significant well yes at 10% it is now let's come back here look at this type 0 1 what is your type 0 means public 1 means private look at the coefficient it is positive now when it is positive look at this this means that private has higher reliability in comparison to public here type is your dichotomous variable binary variable exogenous categorical variable where 1 means private 0 means public 1 is higher 0 is lower look at this positive sign so a positive sign here with this dummy variable here type 0 1 this variable here with a positive sign would mean and this is significant as well there is no zero in between so once this is significant why significant less than 0 0.05 so this means type of bank which type of bank private type of bank private type of bank has higher reliability in comparison to public banks why am i saying that private has a higher reliability why am not why am i not saying that public has a higher because there is a positive sign with it and this positive sign means that the respondents have selected private banks for reliability so when there is a positive sign you will see or you will go for the value that is one or higher in your variable that is binary coded variable in simple terms what what if there would have been a negative sign here let's assume there is a negative sign let's assume it's minus 0.7629 now since it's a negative sign and one is private this means that private has lower reliability in comparison to public banks and is this difference significant yes it is significant because the p-value is 0 0.0137 moving on now that this is done what is w1 w1 is middle rank so middle rank employees there is a positive sign with it and this is significant as well so how do i compare where do i compare this this is compared to the reference category which one is reference category your one is your reference category what is one one is junior so middle rank employees have a higher reliability in comparison to junior level employees why am i saying middle have higher because w1 shows middle rank employees look at this w1 1 and this means w1 shows middle rank employees now w2 look at this one is here this means w2 shows senior level employees but why there is no junior here because junior is your reference category to which all the other categories are compared so w1 here let me clear this out so whenever you've got a multi-categorical variable one value is reference and the other value is compared to that reference category as we did in type where zero was public and one was private so w1 middle rank employees significant so middle rank employees have higher reliability in comparison to junior level employees and is it significant yes the difference is significant what about this w2 look at the p-value 0 0.0997 it is on if it is one tailed you are taking it it as one tailed it is significant because this is greater than 1.645 so you can say this is significant as well so there is a significant difference in the reliability of service by middle and senior level employees in comparison to junior level employees but i'm not interested in comparing 
my middle and senior level to the junior level i'm interested in whether job rank moderates this relationship or not if you look here minus 0.9207 and look at this significant this is insignificant but this is significant what does this mean interaction one now interaction one is type one into w1 so what is type one into w1 let's see this type 01 or type variable that is this your x variable influencing reliability and your job rank is your moderator so what is w1 here w1 here is middle ranked what does this show here this shows here this is significant this shows that the impact of type of bank here the type of bank because this is what you're looking into the impact of type of bank on reliability is weaker the impact of type of bank on reliability is weaker for middle level employees in comparison to junior level employees why am i saying that it is weaker for middle level employees because there is a negative sign here and what is the type of bank type of bank is for one it is private so in private sector banks the reliability is higher in junior level employees in comparison to senior level employees so the relationship of type of bank with reliability is stronger in junior level employees in comparison to w2 w1 sorry so it should be middle level employees yeah here it should be middle level as well in summary this means that private sector banks have a stronger reliability for junior level employees in comparison to middle level employees now let's simplify this a little more if i go to data let's split my file and let's clear all this out let's add job ranks here the different job ranks we've got and just press ok now go to analyze correlate bivariate and let's add liability and type of bank press ok and look at this when the job rank is junior the correlation between type of bank and reliability is 0 0.240 that is significant but when the job rank is middle your correlation is 0 0.053 and that is insignificant now if i compare these correlation results with my results earlier that was i would that i was describing earlier look at this here interaction one negative sign significant differences now this means that in private sector banks reliability of junior level employees is higher in comparison to middle level employees why because have a look here because there is a negative sign this negative sign here means that middle level employees have low reliability or for middle level employees the impact of type of bank on reliability is lower in comparison to junior level employees that's why there is a negative sign and is this significant yes it is significant so the impact of private sector banks on reliability is better in junior level employees in comparison to the middle level employees otherwise look at this there is a positive sign this means here this positive sign here although this is insignificant but here the positive sign means that senior level employees in private sector banks have higher reliability in comparison to junior level employees 
but this high and low or this difference is insignificant. Although this is slightly complicated, but at times it gets complicated, but I hope it is making sense. Now moving on with this analysis, is your R square change significant with the addition of moderators? Yes, it is significant. Why is it is it is significant? Because your p-value is 0.0448. Moving on. Now if you look here, conditional effects of the focal predictor at the values of the moderator. So if your job rank is junior, what is the impact of type of bank? It is significant. What if your job rank is middle or senior? It is insignificant. And look at this. Job rank is middle. And when it's middle, it has got low reliability in comparison to the junior level. And when it is senior, although the senior have got more reliability, better reliability, but it is insignificant. Now let's summarize it finally and make it easier and let's so my interest was type of bank influencing reliability and job rank was my moderator now the results showed that junior level employees have stronger impact with reference to type of bank on reliability where type of bank one was private so private banks have higher reliability when the employees are junior level in comparison to the other two levels look at this look at the signs earlier i considered it positive as well so just to explain the impacts i hope this session would have helped you understand how to use categorical predictor variables when you're using them as moderator and as an independent variable with a continuous dependent variable